Hey, okay, welcome back to the Mr. Excel podcast. I'm Bill Jelen. Boy, we have a tough one today. We're going to talk about entering times and calculating with times in Excel. We have some experimental data today where the result was 123 minutes and 40 seconds. That's really something that's hard to enter. It's non-intuitive. You have to make sure to enter the zero up front. Zero hours and then a colon, 123 colon 40 seconds. And even when you do that, Excel converts it to some fractional portion of a day. And so we go into format cells, which is control one, and we could choose that we have some sort of a time format, but then Excel loses the fact that it was minutes and seconds. It converts it to hours and minutes for us. So if we go back to format cells and choose custom, the numeric format that we need is in square brackets, we want to put the M for minutes and then a colon and then two S's for seconds. That actually allows us to see the time in minutes and seconds. So I formatted all of these cells over here with that format. And now if I need to total, I can use alt equals to put the total in and average equal average and choose the average. Now, since those cells were already formatted with the special format and we created a formula from those cells, Excel copied the format over for us. And so everything looks good to go. Tomorrow we'll have another example with time that may be more tricky. Thanks for stopping by. We'll see you tomorrow for another podcast from Mr. Excel.